cute, cuddly and often difficult to spot, especially when their numbers are declining. Traditionally, koalas have been counted by people on the ground. Now they can be tracked by robots from the air. Researchers from the Queensland University of Technology have sent up drones armed with infrared cameras. We're a little bit sceptical that it would work, but when we saw the images come through, we saw the koalas are very distinct in the, compared to the trees and the environment. So we thought, yes, this is absolutely a, a proof of concept that it could work. Their first test flight was in bushland surrounding Australia Zoo on Queensland's Sunshine Coast. The cameras detect the animal's body heat and beam pictures straight back to the team below. We have tested at 20 metres and 80 metres. At 20 metres we got really good, really good resolution. Computer software helps distinguish koalas from other creatures that might be in the trees. So this will drastically reduce the manpower, will greatly increase the area that can be covered to survey koalas um, in areas where people may not be able to walk through because of dense undergrowth. And give a more accurate count of a drastically dwindling population. Can we then use the technology and to see how they behave, how they reintegrate, monitor their health? The Koala Foundation says it won't be enough to save the creatures. Every single tree in Australia right now needs to be protected. And unless that happens, I can promise you the koala's going to go to extinction. An outcome researchers are striving to avoid. Jessica Van Bonderen, ABC News, Brisbane.